Hey guys, welcome back to some more World Snooker Championship 2007 and part 5 of our career mode. In today's episode, we have the final of the Grand Prix. We're going to be playing Stephen Hendry, 7-time champion of the world and king of the Crucible. He is going to be a very, very tough opponent to beat. Uh, I mean, if we look at the... Uh, at the rankings, he is right up there. He'll be probably number two in the world. There he is, uh, just off number one, uh, where Ronnie O'Sullivan is. Steve Davis is, funnily enough, number three. John Higgins, four. Stephen Maguire, five. Sean Murphy, six. Doherty, seventh. And Peter Ebden rounding out the top eight. So we've already beat the, th uh, the first and third best players in the world uh, this week. We also beat Barry Hawkins, the world number ten. So... This is going to be tough. It is going to be incredibly tough. But uh, we'll try our best against the seven-time world champion. Without further ado, we'll get into it. It'll be a best of 19 match. Um, which means that we'll spread it over a few episodes, of course. Probably four. Uh, starting today, we'll do um, two episodes Saturday, Sunday. Uh, and probably the final session this time next week. And uh, start World Snooker Championship 2009. Um... A week on Saturday, if you get me. Depending on how this goes, we might get beat 10 nil, uh, <laughs> But uh, hopefully not. We'll try our best. Um, yeah. Here we are for this prestigious final at the Grand Prix. It's time to welcome the players into the arena. So let's give them a big hand. Then first frame of the final, and uh, we'll be getting underway. Obviously, another glitch there with the uh, the the announcer not announcing Stephen Hendry's name. So may maybe Barry Hawkins does have a name after all on this game. But uh, here break, we go. John Parrott once again in the commentary box, as he has been for every episode of this series so far. Who a break off then. from us there? And Stephen Hendry straight into the pack. One. Well, he's one of the best positional players in the game. Great cue ball control. Apparently it does. So already a good start Spoiled. for Stephen it's Hendry. A good chance to get this first frame on the board. 50. He's already left himself a fairly difficult shot though. So, you know... Not the best. Goes in, but 60. wrong side of the pink. So he has to drop that in, and now 22. another tricky little shot. He's in pretty good shape here. The position looks good. Good. Yeah, well played. But a little bit straight. So just 29. a little bit of hard work so far for Stephen Hendry. 30. Good sh Great position. Yeah, that's a nice shot. He's got a good option in the red near the black. He's played that well, good but again, shot. the wrong side of the pink. Forty. Well, does that one outside the pack go? If it does, he's in good shape. If it doesn't, this is just going to be a safety. Must and it did, and he's on the Four. black. Four. It's well. a decent break, that. Fifty-one. That's a decent shot. But again, just not 52. the right side of the the pink, and he's hit the brown. Came close to potting the wrong ball. Now is Great he on it? Great ball control. Uh, I guess he's on the the red at the bottom. Yeah. 
59. Again, tricky positional shot. He's on a decent run He's of gone scoring. into them. Very 66. fortunate there. Yeah, nice shot. 67. Just this black to take a 1-0 lead, and what a break this has Four been. Position. But this time... Not quite on anything. Although he's knocked in a ridiculous one there with a spider. 75. 78. Well, is he going to open this cent uh, this final with a sentry? He has a very no no. Oh, oh great potty. Just drop. 87. Bit lucky that didn't go in. 95. Good luck getting on the red here. Poor position. And he doesn't. One. But he gets the sentry. Plays the double. Doesn't quite get it. So Stephen Hendry with that break of 101 takes the opening frame. And he leads 1 0. So. I don't know how many frames we'll play. We'll sort of just run the time, really. We'll try and aim for half an hour episodes. And see how many frames that actually is. Well, a... Looks like he wants to get up and go home. Good break off. I'm going to play a slightly more attacking shot. Oh, where's that red going? Well, Won't get position. <laughs> we'll settle for what? that. Won't be long before he'll be trying to bring a few reds out into the open. Right. So we're looking at this, uh, this brown into the middle, which is a tough shot, by the way. But how are we going to get on a, a red? That is uh, uh, the problem that we face. Couldn't pot Not it. Quite. We went into the pack, managed to get on a red as well, so maybe a little bit too attacking there. Stephen Hendry once again is in. How's position? Opens the, opens the pack beautifully. Four. The only problem is that that black Five. is out of commission for the moment. This pink is. Uh, oh, well, he's brought it out. Now. Eleven. <sighs> Lovely positional. Twelve. Yeah, that's a nice uh, position on the on the black the brown here. Brown spot is the only place it can go. Nineteen. Yeah, so he's just going to have to focus 20. on the pink with the black up the other end of the table. Well, now he's brought the pink spot into play. Pop the black and have that back on that spot Still now. Shot there. Still not in ideal position. 35. Oh, what a shot. 40. What a blue that was. Stephen Hendry can apparently play left-handed as well. <laughs> 48. 9. Won't get position. I was wrong. 57. Well, yellow and one more red. We'll put the frame safe. I'll tell you what, this is cracking stuff from Stephen Hendry early in this match. 60. Slight pressure on this next shot. Hasn't missed a ball yet. 67. It's looking good with this visit. Nothing spectacular. 75. Looking like he's going to get a second century of the match here. The only problem is the brown, but he won't need it, so... For the sentry, that is. 91. Just the black and yellow. And a second sentry of the match. Good shot. 100. Bit Can he put the brown? brown. <laughs> what a, well, what a shot. Hendry, at his absolute best. Two sentries to open the final. 101 and 125 and within 10 minutes of this episode we are already 2-0 behind in this final unbelievable it never helps to be behind in a match
He has to try and make every shot count. I think we've had the grand total of three shots. We obviously missed the um, we missed the the brown in the last frame. But apart from that, we've done nothing no wrong. Well, pff, we went for that. Goodness me. He's got safe though. If you're going thing. to play safe, or has you he? can't afford nah, to do half a job. So we're going to play a little plant here. Try and get on the black, if possible. Went for the risky yeah. plant. Had no problem. It's a good pot, and he's well poised for the next. Now I know we'll probably not bring much into play here, but if we go into the pack, we know we've got that red over the corner. Worst case scenario. Eight. And I th think, well, we can still plant, surely plant something onto it. That's ridiculous how we're, we're not on that. Um. Oh dear. Well, I'm going to have to jack our cue in the air. It's starting to get a little warm in here. Either that or it's just all the excitement at the table having an effect. No. Well, this has gone terribly so far this match. You have to say, we won lucky that we didn't uh, get on anything there. Six. I honestly thought that was, it was impossible to not get on that red, but apparently 14. not. And, well, can Steven put in another frame 15. win and break here? Really put us up against it. Twenty one. Twenty two. Still a little bit of work to do in this frame. Shouldn't be any. It's twenty nine. I thought he might have took the opportunity to go into them there. I'm not position. sure what he's going to play now. Thirty five. Unless there's not a plan. by nope. an opponent at all. Well. Interesting. Yep, he's taken any potential sting out of that one by putting it safely in the balk. So, Stephen Hendry is human oh, apparently in this not game. To consider the safety, wouldn't he? That's a Love. safety shot, and that's pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. I mean, he's left a, a chance of a, a not shot the for nothing here. Strongest in the game, this man. So if we knock that in, come round the back of the black. If we miss it, it should go safe. Found the gap brilliantly. One on the brown. The blue looks about his best chance. So he missed the brown in the last frame. It was a much more difficult brown. But still. Yeah, nice pot. And absolutely Five. inch perfect on this red. So this is a good chance now to get back into the match. And really, we need to be taking these chances. We've do seen Stephen Hendry put in two sentries already. Six. He's 22 points ahead in this frame. I think he's probably got the requisite so angle to be nicely on the next red. If we miss here, we're going to be 3-0 down. Oh, dear. Well... We've got a potential shot up into the corner. I don't think that goes actually. So we'll have to be the, the one into the middle, which is not ideal. We're a little bit fortunate to be on this, to be honest. I'm dying for a nice cuppa. Milk and two sugars if you're listening, Mr. Producer. <laughs> right, we're going to just drop this in. And it's there. 14. Good recovery shot. Drop this pink in. Cannon into these the pink reds. Nicely there. And hopefully we're on this red. Although I don't think we are. So again, slightly more difficult shot. Again, should be okay. But it's more difficult than it should have been. But it goes into the pocket now. 21. He's got to travel around the table here. So Will he take the, the yellow one? More difficult blue. 
down to one of them reds. Nice You're pop. Right. 26. So, we'll just drop this, this red, red in. should give him the requisite angle for the black, which in turn will leave him on the next red. 27. And we know in amongst the balls we're in a pretty good form. Angle to be nicely on the next red. It's a decent pot that puts him in a good position. 34. He'll probably want to get position back on the black. Yep, it was a great pot and he got a great position too. Just a little screw shot there. 35. Might even get rid of that red while we've got the little opportunity. Nice pot on the black. 42. The red will go, I'm sure of that. Forty three. So, yeah, we're in a good place here. Already twenty three points in front, so just this red, a black, and one more red. And he's well poised for the next. Well, as long as we get a decent angle on this black. Fifty one. Mm. Couldn't have been straight there, in all this honesty. Black will surely go. I think we've got to screw and try and develop this red. Oh, and it hasn't nope. happened. So, if he gets this red, the frame's his. This is it's a disappointing shot. Difficult shot. He's got it all to do on his next. It's a tough one, though, because... You know, that. The more side we play on this, the, the more missable it gets. But we need to play with side in order to play safe. So, well, we're going for it. Is it? Wasn't no, to be? Not quite. And I, well, that kiss on the yellow means that Stephen can pop this. And this will be a tough frame to take. One. Because we've had a really good chance there. He's played a good shot there. Nine. He knows in an incredibly difficult situation. No so problems with Steve the brand. Hendrick can clear these colours, which he will 16. do. He's going to be 3 0 up. And that's disappointing. Long position. Yes. So just 26. this black and Stephen Hendry takes a 3 0 lead, well and there it is, right at the heart of the pocket. Oh, Stephen Hendry leads 3 0. He's ahead at the moment, which always helps psychologically. He can be safe in the back of the ball. I mean, for such a terrible break off, we he got quite a lot of uh, applause there. Right, so what we want. That's okay. Yeah, that's exactly what we want. Nice line. Try and get this behind those two nice colours. Safety. And that is absolutely inch perfect. I think Question the cushion is. is only escape route here. Well, he is snookered. What's it's he left? Safe. I'm pretty sure that, that loose red near the cluster will go. That's just not good enough at this level. One. It's a decent pot that puts him in a good position. And this one we definitely have to take. Eight. You know, There's so a chance it could, could be argued. We were going to steal the last frame off Stephen after he got in first. This one we're in first. Good pot. Nine. So these are the we frames. Too disappointed to be going for black again. But we have to be winning the last one before give it the mid-session interval. The brown spot is the only place it can go. Oh, that's disappointing. 
did, certainly did not want to tie the black up like that. If we go on the pink, I'll have to off, but I think it's just not far enough. So we'll have to be the blue. Screw it back, leave a good angle on this red to go into the pack. Skillful shot there. 22. Almost the too much angle. really showing on his face, looking very stressed. He's got this to find a to way to bring some reds into play soon. And it does. Two have gone in. Two reds 24. went in there. I think he fancies another go at the blue. And one good not pot on the blue. The pot, but not overly tough either. We're in a good position. Good pot. A good blue. Are we on a red? 29. The red will get him on the colour, and then he'll be thinking of the next red. I quite fancy this one to get us onto the blue nicely. Now, you'd never ever take that in real life, but... You know, desperate times. He's probably got the requisite angle to be nicely on the... And now we've got the pink in a nice position. He's going to go back on a spot now, which is not necessarily what I was hoping for, but it's fine. Didn't want to hit that red. 43. I wonder if he'll opt for the red near the pink. So just a little bit more difficult to, a shot here. Um, run on and off the cushion. Should be on the pink. Just Good a little bit shot. too much. Again, should be okay. That's fine. So, screw on and off the cushion here. Or stun, I should say. More of a stun shot. And now 51. we are in the perfect position. This is uh, sort of opportunities you have to take again, Stephen. 57. It's there. He's not a great positional player. I think he might find it hard to keep the cue ball under control here. And it's there. Uh, a little bit of pressure on this shot. So just this red. Looking good. Uh, there 65. we go. We finally got our first frame on the board. Room then. 71. Well, we've held ourselves together well here. Can we get another sentry in this tournament? 78. Seventy-nine. Well, we should do from this position. Well, we've uh, we've held ourselves Good. together nicely. Eighty-five. And, you know, at least we're showing Stephen that we can actually win a frame in this match. So we'll try and get on this pink. If he looked any more relaxed, he'd be asleep, wouldn't he? Bad positional. I don't think he can cut this in, can he? Well, I think you can. Oh, what a shame. Well, a nice break there of 98, I think it was, in the end. And we reduce our deficit at the mid-session interval to 3-1.
Now, I'm just thinking whether we continue the episode now or leave it till next time. It's about 25 minutes, so we'll, we'll try and uh, do that now. Um, we'll, we'll leave it here. And uh, we'll continue on Saturday. So if you have enjoyed that, then make sure you leave a like down below. Really does help me out. It means a lot to me as well. Subscribe to the channel for regular snooker content. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.